completely subordinate, subordinate to Kemet, and they, they misrepresent the totality of that relationship. It's very important to know that when the Kemetic people went to war with anybody, they pretty much called them wretched. <laughs> so they called them barbarians, they said that foe, that wretched person, and, and the folks in Megiddo and the people in Syria and Lebanon were no different. So a lot of times you'll see them hear, you'll hear the word wretched and, and, and enemies and barbarians and, and people who are, who are kind of beneath us. We're going to stomp them under our feet. They say very, very significant and verbose things like that when they're talking about their enemies, especially when they're going to go to battle. And, and if you can imagine what it's like to fight someone 5,000 years ago, 4,000 years ago, you're fighting hand-to-hand -hand combat. So to go to war, you had to pump yourself up. So when we think about you know, the wretchedness, that, that is something that they use a lot of times when you hear them talk about foes. And so one of the first indications around the Battle of Megiddo is not just at the Temple of Amen. Interestingly enough, it's